Wednesday, November 1st, 2023. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic of which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence while we reflect on today's activities and focus on demonstrating our best behavior. Please be seated. Warriors, it's flu season and washing your hands with soap for 20 seconds can save your life or someone else's. The 7th grade drama performance Willy Wonka musical will be on November 8th and 9th from 6.30 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. at the Peachtree City United Mythical Church. The 8th graders will be performing on November 10th and 11th from 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. It's going to be a great show. You don't want to miss it. In case you didn't know, Friday is school spirit wear. If you want to buy some spirit wear, go to school website, resource, and select PTO on the top menu. You will see school store. Basketball season is coming and you want to wear your spirit wear on the green out days when we have home games. Warriors, basketball season is here tomorrow. Thursday, November 2nd is your first opportunity to show up here at Booth wearing your spirit wear. The boys and girls team will be playing tip-off for the girls will be at 5 p.m. and the boys game will be at, begin at 6.15 p.m. Warriors, the yearbook staff has been working hard to get you in the yearbook three times or more. When you see them taking photos, please be cooperative and don't hide from the camera and don't use signs. It is so important to get us all in the yearbook. Car riders, please pay attention out front and watch for parents. There are 1,100 of us to get dismissed at the end of the day, and we want things to move along smoothly. Bus riders, make sure to stay on the sidewalk if your bus has not arrived yet. Also, please pay attention to the buses. You don't want to miss your ride home. Stay in the right path. A warrior is always prepared, accountable, accountable thoughtful, thoughtful, and helpful. And now for the character lesson. for that book. <laughs> Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Cullen and Caitlin with a few words of wisdom. Despite the fact that we all look very different on the outside, there are many things we have in common on the inside. One of these things is our failings. We have our little faults. We all do little things that we shouldn't and things that we regret later. Now listen to these words that come from a French scholar named John de la Bruyer. Two people cannot long be friends if they cannot forgive each other little failings and focus on the better, the bigger and better part of who we are. It's true, you know today. Today let's forgive each other little failings and focus on the bigger and better part of who we are. With something to think about, this is Caitlin and Cullen. Make it a great day or not, the, the choice, choice is always yours. The word of the day is reconcile. It is a verb. The definition is to settle or resolve. A sentence is, instead of spending a fortune in court fees, the two parties have agreed to see a mediator to reconcile our differences. Reconcile. I dare you to use this word today. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Jose Brion, the weather for Wednesday, October 1st, 2023. The high for today will be 66 degrees and the low will be 55 degrees with an 8% chance of rain. There will be races today. Tomorrow, the high will be 52 degrees and the low 37 degrees with a 6% chance of rain. Have a great day, Warriors. Suicide is the third leading cause of death from ages 15 to 24. If you hold it in, it'll come out in a negative way. It's okay to say how you feel. It's okay to ask for help. Feeling sad but saying you're good. Keeping it in makes it worse. 30% of teens feel stressed out. Talk to your friends. Talk to parents. 
percent of teens have anxiety. Are you one of them? You're not alone. It's okay to say that you're not okay. You can call the National Suicide Hotline at 1-800-950-6264. 1-800-950-6264.